Uh, we were asked if I could give a virtual tour of my library, the office here, so that's what we're about to do. This is the outer room where I meet with people, do counseling, that sort of thing. This is the outer room, and this is where I write and try to figure out what to write. So that I've got two basic um, sections for my office here. And this probably has about two-thirds of my books. The other third, probably thereabouts, is, is all at home. Do you mind so we'll just start here. The, what this is going to do is give a sensation, if you can't look at every book, that I'm far more organized or that the books are far more organized than they actually are. There are sections that are not uh, all that tidy. But here, uh, Psalters and Hymnals, music, books on music, uh, collection of Psalters and Hymnals. Um, I've got my uh, Recon uh, collection, Rush Dooney, Rush Dooney is here, um, Bonson, uh, T.S. Eliot Machen, F.F. F. Bruce is here, um, H.L. Mencken is here, uh, Gary North, and more Gary North and related folks. And here's some random beer bottles, uh, Calvinist beer and Black Douglas and things like that. So. Um, Moving over one bay, here's a section on liturgics, a section on worship and worship music. Um, this would be the section on scriptures and uh, uh, manuscripts, text criticism, that sort of thing. Hermeneutics and exegesis is next. And then I'm running out of room, so this section on preaching and, preacher, preaching and preachers is here. And then the sacraments, uh, uh, baptism, the Lord's Supper, issues and church polity is here. Uh, the next bay, science and evolution, a couple of uh, uh, a couple of shelves, si science, evolution g generically and also uh, young earth creationism, that sort of thing, intelligent design. Um, N.T. Wright and related folks. This shelf is kind of hodgepodgey, not uh, some stuff on Islam but not uh, not that well organized. And then here is some of my Spurgeon stuff, and then some Latin Latin stuff, and some early Puritans, Bradford, uh, Tyndall, there. Then early church fathers, uh, early church fathers, and then Judaic stuff, church history, uh, a couple of a couple of sections on Calvinism, actually three shelves on Calvinism, and then a fourth over in the other, I don't know why I've got another one over there, but um, Doctrines of Grace, Calvinism. Uh, this section is, this wall here is kind of a overflow hodgepodge. Um, not a lot of rhyme and reason at the top here, but down below I've got a collection of uh, uh, sermon collections and um, uh, books on revival there and then over here organization creeps back in the lower bays here are collected sets mostly Puritans so uh, there's John Owen and um, Swinnick and uh, uh, Flavel and um, uh, I've got uh, John Murray's over there too John Owen B.B. Warfield uh, John Knox uh, Abreckel Baxter John Bunyan, and then uh, Francis Schaeffer down in the corner. Then this section here is um, apolog basically apologetics, other religions, other communions, denominations, uh, philosophy, that sort of thing here. And then this section up here is more of an overflow again. Not a lot of rhyme and reason there. Someday it will be Someday it will be organized. And I, I'm glad I just saw a 16 edition of the 1611 edition of the King James Bible that I was just looking for the other day. Couldn't find. So I'm glad I'm doing this tour because I found a book I was looking for. Um, in this, <laughs> this section, um, here's, a, here's a rack of books that I've got a label here. Might finish someday. I, <laughs> I, I was reading and got stuck or distracted or you know whatever so I'd like to get back to them perhaps um, uh, some of this other stuff here overflow then here where I do my writing um, 
this is sort of a random collection, uh, random collection, but with a purpose, more of an immediate reference. I do a lot of typing and writing here, and these are books that I would want to pull down or consult or um, look at, and I have them ready to hand. Then um, in this section, um, uh, the top two bays are books that I've edited or written or published or had something to do with. Um, next to them, marriage, family, sexuality, um, there. Then three bays of C.S. Lewis's stuff, um, close at hand. I consult him often. Then the next two are books on education. Um, uh, actually, the four shelves, the, the two on, on the bottom all the way across. So education books. Then right next to Lewis, I've got Chesterton, uh, Tolkien, um, uh, Charles Williams, folks like that. Then this section would be commentaries, um, my commentary sets and individual commentaries and particular um, Bibles. So I've got Bible collections down there. Then in this Bay here, this section, it's uh, wordsmithing, basically. Um, etymological dictionaries, dictionaries, collections of words, odd, odd words, that kind of thing. Here's my other Calvinism section, uh, reformational studies um, here, and more wordsmithing books. Then over on this wall is basically uh, um, the middle section is history, history, American uh, uh, fiction there, American history, um, American history, uh, war between the states, um, uh, here and here. And this would be uh, Reformation history, um, European history, that sort of thing. And of course, while I'm, while I'm explaining all this, people are going to say, but that's not American history. That's because I'm not as organized as it all looks. Uh, in this bay over here, some random uh, PGO, uh, so just authors I have, uh, PGO, Rourke, John Piper, uh, Rene Girard, um, uh, that, that sort of thing. Then over here is politi basically politics. Um, And the, these are books we've published. And then this rack over here and this rack here are all cultural studies, pop culture, uh, cultural analysis, cultural responses. And then uh, I've got a library rack here. These are books recently purchased. Uh, just about all these books are carded so that NSA students can check them out or parishioners can check them out. And we, I get new books and we card them and, uh, and put them on the shelf. and. And I loan them out if I if someone comes in and asks for a book, and if I can find it, uh, we loan them out. Then we uh, um, postmodernism, emerging church stuff is down there, and that is in the main what I have here. The rest is at home. Thank you for joining me. So the, the million dollar question: How many of you read? Oh, the million dollar question. When people say, how many of these, uh, have you read all these is the question. And, and my answer is some of them twice. <laughs> no, I've not read them all. I've read a bunch of them. <laughs>